Sassies, it's Sammy. Welcome to another Sassy vloggy vlog. It's currently 6.09 on a Wednesday morning. I went to bed like 9.45 last night. I was so tired. I just like put my phone away, put my alarm on and fell asleep. And I didn't wake up until like 3.30. Actually, that reminds me, I need to turn my alarms off. I did go on TikTok. I did watch some YouTube videos. And I was like, mm, this isn't like really the vibe of feeling. So I got up, made coffee, um, washed the wares and just kind of tidied up, made a list of things to do this week like just stuff I need to get for the house grocery shopping which I need to put together a list um, I need to call the maintenance guy for something and I just basically wanted to get a jump start to my day I'm going into work at like 8 30 so I have like about two hours and 20 minutes before all that happens right now I'm gonna spend like at least in half an hour doing devotionals and if you guys are curious like what method I use I've been mainly leaning more towards the soap where I write the scripture I kind of like observe it like basically what i take away from that verse um and all that stuff just from reading and what it means to me a is for application like how i'm going to apply it to my life and like actually use it to be more like christ and then a prayer like something i want to pray about with god and work on um and i just am using the good notes app on my ipad nothing fancy i just was checking my emails and realized that i got an email at 4:10 for like a prayer for the new year and i just wanted to share it with you guys i didn't like write this or anything it's like an email from the U version bible app so it just says a prayer for a new year whatever last year looked like this year is an opportunity for a fresh start as a global community we have an opportunity to pray over our lives and the lives of millions across the world it says imagine what god can do if you join in prayer with our community all praying the same prayer to the same faithful god it says god you are the light of the world because of you, I no longer walk in darkness, but in your light. May my life reflect your truth, pointing others to you and bringing glory to your name. Give me the strength and courage to share the hope that I have in you. This world is broken, but you make what's broken whole again. This year, draw near to the lost, the lonely, and the hurting, and please draw near to me. May your love bring us together, mending division and unifying your global church. No matter what this year holds, you are faithful and your promises are true. Thank you for the eternal hope that I have in you. In Jesus' name, amen. I look crazy still. It's 7.37. I have just under an hour to get out of here. But these are the leggings. I don't like how these are made. The style is super cute though. Like, look at it. It's just so girly. It screams Love Shack fancy, but like not the price. If I can find these online, I'll link them. And I bought the top separately. However, I think I wore this one time. Literally brands making new, no stains, nothing. I love the two different patterns. So of course I want to wear the set together. They made them so poorly with this plastic thing that like popped off this size. So I just found a bow in my drawer <laughs> to fix it. So basically I just took the bow and wrapped it around here and tied it through here. So I can wear my top. <laughs> It's not even like, I feel like I'm wearing a diaper on my boot. It's such a cute set though. Like it has so much potential, but like the design style is stupid. I don't know. This makes it feel just like so flat. I don't know. This isn't like your traditional like bra, I feel like. I don't know. But yeah, this is the little outfit. I don't know. It looks a mess, but whatever. Like I don't feel like getting dressed today. And then for shoes, I haven't worn these yet, but I got them specifically for working out. They're only brand new. But these are the Asics little trainers. They're like my Cinderella shoes, I call them, because they're blue. It's giving very much need to go shopping for closet staples. If you guys know how to like get your white clothes stark white, let me know because I actually love white activewear. And I'm gonna wear a jacket. It's clean, it smells good, but it has like armpit stains. And I'm not gonna lie, I got those when I was using the native deodorant, which I don't like by the way. But I feel like it just stains my clothes. And it also could be like my body chemistry as well with the deodorant and like what called the discoloration so i can't like get out the darker color i don't know how to get my jacket to kind of be stark white again how i love i love 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 white activewear i just think it's so feminine and it goes with everything i don't always want to wear black i love black but like black doesn't scream girly it's screaming very much sporty and like I love that, but I wear black all the time. Not the squeak. And I'm only wearing these in my house because I haven't worn them outside. You're sitting on a pile of clothes. So this is the jacket. Super clean, obviously it looks white on camera, 
but the underarm part is like the darkest like driving me insane i didn't shave my underarm so don't come for me how do you take the how do you take the squeak out of your shoes anyway as the pants kind of like fall down on me because they like fit i think everything is in a small i think but like this baggy like i don't like this anyways this is my outfit for today like i don't know what the and whatever i'm just going with the flow today i don't feel like getting dressed i don't and i don't even feel like putting gel in my hair because i had a blowout a few days ago i just don't want to put gel in it i need to take out or i need to put on my contacts too Forgive me, I turned off the living room light. It's 8.05, I have 25 minutes to get to work. Love that for me. I'm gonna make a smoothie really quick just to go because I'm actually kind of hungry and I don't feel like making oatmeal or buying anything. So protein smoothie it is, that should last me until lunchtime. So it's like four, eight, let's do nine, 10, 11, 12, like one. We get like four or five hours. I think a protein smoothie would be good. I love just a blush. I didn't even put moisturizer on. I wash my face, just blush and a little lip oil from Merit, blush from Kylie, like it's not even a blush, it's a pink eyeshadow, and then mascara from the Maybelline like lash stuff. It's like a pink little tube. But yeah, that's all I'm wearing. I I was looking for stuff to put on, but I was like, I already put the blush on, I'm not going back in with like an oil or serum, so. Dry face Wednesday. Because I'm on my lunch break from work and I came home to change into my dance clothes because I decided I'm gonna go to dance today so I didn't bring my clothes to work. I'll just wear this. And then I'm actually wearing pink tights with black today. Like this is my dance outfit. Just because I've been wearing a lot of pink. Actually headed back to work and then, yeah. And this is my cup. She's glowing. So I actually have like 25 minutes left of my break. My sister's gonna take me back. I literally use my sister for everything. <laughs> Why would I need to buy a car when I can pay my sister to do it? So she picked me up on my lunch break, took me home. I literally got in my dance clothes and then she's gonna come back to pick me up from work to take me to dance class. <laughs> um, I'm wearing the YSL Libre. Libre, it smells so good. Anybody here who's new to the program yes that would be you know something you want to you know catch up on a little bit next thing is finally you can take off with your limbs that means you have to stay square between your hips and shoulders as we know so when you move your arm you should move your shoulder you move your left your hips should not be with that okay when you dance you most of your weight keeper should be on the ball of your feet okay and you want on one foot your hip should be over the toe, the big toe, and the shoulder should stay over your hip line. So these are the things you should look out for. All right, so let's start with the warm up, which is now.
six and seven, we talked about the head, right? And eight. Domitrie, hold. Domitrie, first position. Ograndrie, you are down. Okay? Three and four. Slowly bring the arm first position. Try to let go of the bar. Then you take it down the flat first, open the arms, then you point your toe. The next position is the fit. You do the fit the same way. Don't forget the roll away must be adjusted with the right foot, right? Cover the left foot really tight. That's important because you're going to start learning this semester of turns. Open again, okay? And down and back to first. Okay? Yeah? We still not done. Then you take the back to the front. Halfway down, comes up, to the back, good, open it out, have both arms up and you outside, and then towards the bar, inside. Mm -hmm.